The storm that tore through eastern Kentucky overnight left thousands without power early this morning, and many are still without it. In fact, some of those winds in Pike County alone set down several trees onto power lines and also onto roadways. 13 News reporter Lane Ball joins us with a story of one first responder who ended up having to fight for his life. What we've seen here is uh, widespread power outages and a lot of trees down. Uh, the storm hit late Sunday night and continued until early Monday morning. One of our members was responding to another call with us and ran up on a tree. 30 year old Jimmy Belcher was dispatched to Kentucky Route 460 when he struck a tree lying in the road. When he got out of his truck to move the tree, I was struck by an oncoming vehicle, uh, which has left him in critical condition with uh, severe head trauma uh, and several broken, broken bones. Belcher was transported to a nearby hospital where he is currently being treated for his injuries. Fellow firefighters say that while the accident was devastating. The best thing that we can do, all of us, is pray for both of these young men, their families, our departments, and our communities. The incident also damaged several businesses. A Save-A-Lot grocery store had to close its doors with part of its roof damaged as a result of the high-powered winds. The area electric company is currently working to restore power to those affected. There's currently no set time for complete restoration. In Pikeville, Lane Ball, 13 News, working for you.